Hi, this is Julie Waldorf, juliewaldorf.com, and I have Ed Waggy here with the City Council of Pismo Beach. And Ed, you spoke at our MLS meeting, and um, um, could you tell us, you're, you're a guy that keeps things simple. How are you keeping things simple at different, different subjects? Well, we need to have clear, concise regulations when we do have regulations. Uh, many of the regulations I've seen in the county right now are just too complicated to be able to figure out how to comply with them. I would propose that we make sure that if you have to have regulations, that the regulations are easy to follow, they make sense, and they have a good public purpose. So, like, for example, one of the regulations they're trying to put on there is that people need to make their house um, um, uh, uh, energy efficient before they can sell it, which is kind of ridiculous, don't you think? Yeah, that's going way too far. It would, our, our local real estate industry is already hurting a lot, and we don't need more regulations of that type. We just hurt it even more. What we need are voluntary measures to make sure that we can uh, have more energy efficient homes, but not have it mandated by the government. Yeah, it should, it should stay as a choice for the people of getting it done or buying a house that has it or not. You should keep it a choice, don't you think? Absolutely. Make you it know? a choice not a requirement, educate, uh -huh. but not require, yes. Right, and what about the vacation rentals? You're trying to make it where you only can vacation rental your house a few days a week, or what's that craziness about? It has to do with just too, con too much convoluted regulations. It should be simple, straightforward, so you can uh -huh. figure out how to do it instead of these complicated, onerous regulations. Yeah, yeah, you know, vacation rentals are a good thing for the economy and a good thing for people coming in and, and for tourism and, and, and creating revenue flowing around. And to eliminate and make that complicated is um, actually pretty uh, stupid as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> well, well, we to, you know, because, I, you know, that's the word for it. I hate to say the word, but that's no, it. I know. Well, you we know? need some, we need some regula regulations of vacation rentals so right, that your local residents are not bothered by lots of noise. That was, you know, well, you loud parties and so forth. There's yeah. ways of doing that, right. but to make it very complicated is just unnecessary. Yeah, and it eliminates the revenue and cash flow and all that. And by the way, from my experience, I came from Breckenridge, Colorado, where there's lots, millions of people that come through that county, and they got it dialed in on the vacation rental. They have it, they have it real well, and most of the vacation rental people are quality people coming to the area sure. to um, for this area to enjoy the beach. And they're in yes. and out of there three, four days. It's actually very good for the area and the neighborhood and everything, actually. The houses are kept well. Everything's good. Yes, so if it's from what I know. If it's done right, yeah. yes, it can be very effective. Yeah. It's got to be done right. Right now, I think there's too many problems with the way it's currently written. Well, they just need to keep it simple, and that's what you're all about, aren't you? need to keep it simple and straightforward, yeah. yes. Well, Ed, thank you so much. And there's tons of other issues, but you're all into keeping it simple and common sense and, and all of that, so uh, let's vote you back in. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Julie. I'm running for third district supervisor. Uh -huh. The election is on June 5th. Thank uh -huh. you. And uh, what's your contact information if anybody wants to get a hold of you or a web Website or something? Uh, it's wagi.net, W A A G E.net, and uh -huh. there's contact information there. All right, well, thank you very much, and have a great day. Thank Julia you. Julia Waldorf, Julia Waldorf.com. Ciao, ciao.